for a I know for a fact that there's someone out there that's going to think just because we're getting some new but unreleased shit for the Wrath of Cortex means that we're getting a remaster and quite frankly you sir or ma'am or a goddamn fool if you think that is the case. But anyways, disregarding what you think of the Wrath of Cortex, this footage of the prototype version of Crash 4 is actually what the project was intended to be. The camera was simply fixed and since polygon limitations weren't such of an issue, or much of an issue, excuse me, for the PlayStation 2, this was the visual of a concept that was initially planned for the Wrath of Cortex. Mark Cerny's original idea for Wrath of Cortex was for it to have linear paths as well as semi-open areas. In my opinion, this shit looks a lot more interactive and interesting rather than the final product itself that was released to consoles. And there's not really much to go off besides the fact that the environments are actually alive and it looks pretty exciting, even for something that was rendered in Maya. Uh, the links to the source will be in the description. There is a comparison video for this as well that you can watch on the GamerHut channel. Um, I think this was a guy that previously worked uh, at Traveler's Tales or something like that, but yeah, that's that's where the source came from. This this uh, footage was actually shown off before way a uh, long time ago. We've seen this before, except it's in higher quality now, so I just thought I'd just bring uh, some more light to it. I just talk about it a bit, and really, I wish there was more to talk about, but since we know Wrath of Cortex is nothing but a fucking buffed up steroid tr trasher version, trash version of... Uh, Crash 3, it's uh, there's really not much to go off of, so yeah, I'm gonna end the video off, and I'll see you guys whenever I upload, if ever. Goodbye. What have I got?